The next set of root optimization features to go live will allow you to configure root optimization to work best for you. As you can see in the top right hand corner, RO is in green, which means there is an optimized route available for me. The first change allows you to number the next set of pins so you know exactly where you're going to be going. As you can see, the pins are numbered here one through five. I can update this by going to settings and changing the number of next stops to 16. And now you can see the next set of pins are numbered. The next change allows you to show all the pins that you've got to do. So to do this, you go to settings, show all pending stops. And if I zoom out, this will show all the pins I have to do, including the ones which are numbered. You can combine this with changing the number of next stops and see exactly where you'll be going that night. The third change allows you to automatically select the next stop when completing a delivery. To do this, go to settings and make sure automatically select next stop is turned on. When I complete this delivery, it will automatically select the next pin I've got to do, and so on. If I turn this off, you'll have to manually select the next stop when you complete a delivery, just like this. So now it says, please select next stop, which I'm going to do, choose this one, and then I can mark it as delivered. The final change is to allow you to remove a pin from the sequence. For example, if you can't get there because of a road closure. To do this, press the timer button on the left of the V1 item, click OK, and now that pin is removed from the sequence. This will always show whether you have pending stops on or off because this is an unoptimized, this is now an unoptimized drop.